Welcome back to Day Schedule, your appointment scheduling software. In this video tutorial, I'll be talking about workflows. Workflows are the best way to reduce no-shows and to communicate with your clients before and after the event. In this video, I'll be creating a workflow for the automatic reminder. For that, you need to click on the Add button. And here in the first section, you have to provide the detail for the workflow. That is name of the workflow. Then you have to select an event for the workflow. And in the next field, you need to specify when this workflow should trigger. It's an automatic reminder, so it should trigger before the event at the event start. The difference between these two fields is before event, you can specify how long before the event it should trigger. It can trigger 15 or 30 minutes, an hour or days before the event. So you have to select the option here and in event start this will trigger immediately when the event start you need to click on this checkbox to activate this functionality for this video i'm selecting before event and i want 30 minutes before the event in the next section you have to create an action for the workflow i want to send my automatic reminder through email so default it has been selected in the next field you have to specify whom to you want to send the reminder you can send it to the event host invitee invitee guest or all of them so i've selected the first two an email cc option can be used let's say you want to send the automatic reminders to your manager or as well as your team lead or other team members then you can give your give the email addresses here and it will be automatically sent to them. Next, you have to provide the email subject. And you have to select a template for the reminder. You can create your own by clicking on this custom template or you can select from the available templates. Now day schedule has provided various templates for the email reminders. I'll be going with the first one. Click on the select button to select it. So this is how the template will look for the email. Day, with day schedule, you can create multiple actions by clicking on this add button here. Let's say you want to send a separate template to the invitee and host, then you can create multiple actions for that. So I'll be sending a separate template to the invitee and I'll be choosing invitee here. Then you have to provide the email subject. Then you can choose the template as we just did for the first section. Click on select. So this is how the template will look. You can even test these workflows by clicking on test run. So this is how you can create automatic reminder workflows for your event or your meetings. Finally, click on the save button to create this workflow. So your workflow has successfully created. Thank you for your time. Please subscribe to our channel to learn more about product features and upcoming updates. Thank you.